G'day guys, I'm going to show you a quick video on how to get custom keyboard shortcuts on Cubase and just show you some of my favorite ones. So when working with audio, personally, I like to create uh, a loop that works. that by chopping it up, moving it around, reversing it, and just playing with it until it works. Um, but then once I've finished playing around and I find something that I feel works, I like to bounce that as a solid audio clip and then move on. So to do that, usually I would have to go right click. And if you don't have this if you have the um the other toolbar that comes up when you right click it's easy just go preferences tools and click this off pop up toolbox on right click and that will get rid of that so we can right click and go down to audio we can click bounce selection and we can replace that event now I don't really like to go through menus that much, so I'm going to create a shortcut for this. File. So we go up to File. Uh, we go down to Key Commands. Now any command in any of the menus can have a key command uh, dedicated to it. So simply I'm going to put a key command to that bounce selection. So we type in bounce search for it as you can see I've already created one but if you don't have one it will be obviously blank so we just highlight over it and then we type in the command that we want to put in so shift command B and then we go assign and that will assign it to the command so now if I do command shift B replace there we go it's the same now I've done a few key commands like this. Um, one is when I'm playing around with audio, so I'll undo this uh, to reverse some things. I could right click, go down to audio or process, process, and click reverse. However, I've got a keyboard shortcut set up, Command Shift R. This is an interesting menu. If I go continue, it does it for all of them. See? So, so what we want to do is I never, never say please don't ask me again because I, I don't know which one I'm going to be using for any given project. So I always, I always usually go create a new version. I'm not always 100% sure, so just to be safe, I leave that on. And there we have it, a reverse bit. So I like that sort of toing and froing flow of this, so I'm going to leave it like that. Now I'm going to, I'll play that for you in context. Wrapped up in this game. 